Much has been made about the J. Crew ad featuring the child getting his toenails painted pink. And I've been thinking about it for several days now, and I've basically come to the conclusion that if I was to have a son, I would never paint his toenails pink. At the same time, if he was to come to school and there was another boy who had his toenails painted pink, I wouldn't teach him to discriminate or disrespect him in any way, shape, or form, because I do believe in respect for people of all different backgrounds, cultures, and, and lifestyles. And also, I know that this would not say anything particular about this child's lifestyle, but what bothers me in particular about this particular issue is that I believe that we're moving towards a, a unisex culture in America and this is a, a serious problem for me. I, I do believe that the beauty that is a girl should be celebrated, the beauty that is a boy should be celebrated. I don't believe in having stereotyped roles that have oppressed women over the years but I do believe that as parents our job is becoming a little bit more complicated because I'm raising two girls, and I want them to be independent. I want them to make sure no one's disrespecting them. I want them to be strong-willed. But at the same time, I want them to know that they are women, and that they are beautiful, and that there's beauty in being a woman. Is that a problem? Why is it a problem now if I still choose to open a door for a woman? Am I a sexist in doing that? Those types of lines are, are being blurred in America, and I do believe that it's problematic for us to move towards a unisex culture. So, like I said, I'm not going to be painting my son's toenails pink, but I'm not going to disrespect any other child who does that. But I do believe that we need to celebrate our genders. We are given them for a reason, and I think that they should be respected and celebrated in every way, shape, and form possible. And I'm not one to say which color should be used on, on toenails, but I do believe that this blending of this society as it relates to male and female is problematic for me.